Hey there, my fellow YouTubers, YouTubies, YouTubettes, whatever you want to consider yourself. Welcome to the Imperial Nerds channel. You are watching an Imperial Cinema unboxing. And today I'm unboxing the Stephen King's Under the Dome Special Dome Edition box set. I think this is only uh, available on Amazon or at Amazon.com. I think it's an Amazon exclusive, if I am correct. And uh, yeah, I'm about to unbox it. My beautiful, my precious Goldie is here to help me out with the unboxing. And a little story about this one is funny because I've wanted this for a long time, this box set. It's, it's usually it's 100 bucks. Uh, they had it on sale, I think it was Black Friday or, or near that area for $25. And that day, actually, I could not buy it because I bought a ton of other box sets and movies and all kinds of stuff that I had to leave this one out. So I was pissed that it went back up to $99, close to 100 bucks. Finally, it started dropping, dropping, dropping. And right now, it's at $47.49 uh, on Amazon right here in my little Kindle. You can see it there. $47.49, which is not too bad. If you got that money to splurge, I do not have that much money to splurge, but this is where the little story comes in. As you guys saw in my past videos, if you did not see it, go, go, go see them right now. Go, the, uh, the Strain unboxing, I actually did pay full price for that. The following day after it got shipped, the day after I did my video, they dropped the price down to, I think it's $46. You guys could go check on that video for the link. So I was like, no! Actually, no, it's actually 46, is it? Yeah. So I was like, no, why? And, but luckily, Amazon actually emailed me that same day, said, hey, we dropped the price down of the strain, so we're going to give you a refund for 12 bucks. I'm like, what? Awesome. So they gave me a refund for $12. And also, if you guys saw my past videos again, y'all saw that I, ha I got the Echo. There goes the Echo right there, sitting there next to my chopper yep i got a chopper there and uh it got delayed a whole bunch of times amazon amazon again sent me a message saying hey since the echo has been delayed so much we're gonna give you a ten dollar gift card to make it up for you i was like what awesome so i got twelve dollar refund from the strain a ten dollar gift card because they delayed the echo so that's 22 bucks i put it towards this sucker so i got this sucker for about 22 bucks totally excited to open this bad boy up the show is awesome it's kind of weird in a in a good way i guess you know there's a big crazy dome stuff happening inside what is it no one knows i still can't figure out what it is i'm thinking maybe it's some ufo type of stuff you know what i'm saying but why the ufo why why would aliens you know care about those people i feel like those people are there for a reason because they're most most of them are assholes you know what I'm saying, pretty much. So, I don't know. It's kind of crazy, the story, but it's pretty good. It's, I, I actually enjoy watching it. Uh, if you have Amazon Prime, you can actually watch them, like, as they say, on demand from Amazon. Because they require the, the rights to stream the show. So, definitely, uh, if you got Amazon Prime, go check it out. And as you can see, the box here. This, is actually, this also is the Blu-ray edition of it. It says click clockwise, lift dome upwards away from the tray. We'll get to that in a second. Under the dome. There you go. On the other side, under the dome. On the other side is a little bit of information from the show. And a couple little clips. This guy right here, sometimes he's an asshole, sometimes he's okay. Uh, also his crazy ass son that is ridiculous. All right, special features. Stephen King visits Big Jim's car dealership. The visual effects of Under the Dome. Under the Dome exec executing the finale. The Willington pilot premiere. Under the Dome filming the pilot. The world Under the Dome. Stephen King's and Stephen King and Under the Dome. Under the Dome from novel to series. Under the Dome the first season. 
uh, Joe's blog, gag reel, and deleted scenes. So that is awesome. I can't wait to see the deleted scenes and also the gag reel. To me, gag reels are some of my favorites, you know, seeing the actors mess up and goof off on the set. You know, it just makes them more, uh, more human, you know, because they seem more personable. Yeah, this one's a little hard. Come on, sucker. All right. So, yeah, man, I'm, I'm so excited that I got to, a chance to get this at a cheap deal. But if you guys could afford $47, then go for it before it goes up to... If you guys could afford $47 then definitely go for it because it's, it's not going to stay at that price forever eventually it's going to sell out and uh you're going to find it on ebay for like a thousand dollars damn ebay resellers i hate them so yeah go definitely check it out now the link is in below if you want to buy it uh and get it is either going to go up in price soon or it's going to sell out all right, wipe it down a little bit, really dusty. And here it goes. Oh, this actually has really nice weight to it, guys. You go under the dome. What is this? This is like a porcelain, like a hard resin porcelain base. This is, uh, it pops out so you can actually feel the under the dome letters. The back is nothing there. The bottom, just a made in China. Uh, and some trade paper more crap four little nubbies so it could stay locked in place and as you can see the top of the dome that's where all the action is this is pretty cool you see a handprint right there a bloody handprint gotta be a giant because look at that handprint it's bigger than some of the houses so that's a gigantic ass mofo and if i'm correct the, the cow if you guys seen the show the cow there it goes it's right there if you guys seen the show, uh, one of the first scenes in the show, the cow gets fucked up. You know what I'm saying? It just gets destroyed, cut in half. And there she is right there, cut in half. Awesome. All right, let's see. It goes the tower right there. Over here, you got a farm. Yeah, I think that's the plane, if I'm correct. It looks, uh, the details kind of suck. But at least you can still probably tell as a plane. I'm guessing that's the plane, but why would it be four peaks? I don't know, but uh, there was a plane that crashed. There goes the church. Uh, looks like some kind of weird cemetery there. Like a giant cross. And I just go like this. And you can see the roads, the grass, the trees pretty awesome so let's get to the inside SS twist I think I'm gonna have to take off my gloves for this bad boy oh party time get some of that human skin friction all right so here goes the piece by itself again nothing in the bottom And then here you have the base under the dome book. I mean, not book, just a little. Oh, yeah, there's a little booklet. There's a little booklet there. And it says there, disc one, the pilot, the fire manhunt, special features under the dome, filming the pilot, CBS lunch promos. Lunch. I said lunch. I am pretty hungry. Uh, disc two, outbreak, blue on blue, the endless thirst, imperfect circles, special features, deleted scenes for disc two. Disc three, thicker than water, the fourth hand, let the games begin. Special features, deleted scenes. Uh, disc four, speak of the devil, exigent circumstances, curtains, special features, deleted scenes. Uh, Stephen King's Under the Dome, Under the Dome from novel to series, the world of Under the Dome and Under the Dome, the first season, and Joe's blog and the gag reel. 
And disc five has the hand, the bloody hand again. Uh, special feature, Stephen King's visit Jim, Big Jim's car dealership. Uh, the visual effects of Under the Dome, Under the Dome exe executing the finale, and the Wilmington pilot premiere. So pretty cool. It goes the uh, the tower and the farm and all that stuff. The tower is there. I guess that is uh, the tower there. It's all white over here. You can see it there. And it goes to farm. So it's pretty cool. And then the disc themselves, they just basic, no, just blue. They don't have no graphics on them. I, I, I kind of hate when they don't put graphics on the on the disc themselves. Uh, this is uh, disc one. Little dividers, that's nice. Keeps them from getting scratched. Uh, disc two. Another divider. Uh, disc three. Another divider, disc four, a divider, and the final a uh, disc five. So pretty nice set. Uh, I, I mean, the show is pretty interesting. If you like stuff that makes you want to think, you know, a show that actually like makes you uh, think about it. You know, like Lost. I remember watching Lost and. Man, was I damn confused about the show. I didn't know what the heck was going on. I didn't know. Uh, I still don't know what happened in that show, man. Lost pretty much gets you lost. That's that's what the whole Lost show is about. It just confuses you. And you don't know what the heck is what, man. Are they in purgatory? Were they in some kind of weird thing there? You know, if, are those, were those uh, others angels or what? Lost is one of the craziest shows I've ever seen. It's just ridiculous. Oop, I, I guess I stacked it wrong, but I'll fix it in a bit. It's just to show you guys. Put it back together again. And uh, so, yeah, this is one of those shows that makes you think, you know, and that's always for me. Uh, that's what makes a show really good. If you can't figure it out as soon as the show starts, because if you could figure it out, then what's the point of keep watching? You know, of, 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 you know, you need to uh, have something that keeps bringing you back to the show. And if you figure the show out in a second, then there's no point to watch it anymore. And Under the Dome is one of the shows where you don't know what the heck is going on. Is this a science experiment from the government? Are these uh, aliens uh, trying to uh, save mankind? Are these angels and demons uh, doing some kind of test uh, to, to test them for their uh, purity or kindness or, you know, save their souls? I still have not figured it out. So, you know, what I mean, if you see if you watch this video and you think you have an idea as to what the heck is going on here, definitely comment below because it'll be interesting to see people's uh, different opinions as to what's going on. I really have no idea. I could guess maybe... Uh, some kind of a religious thing and they're being tested you know for you know because their souls are damned or doomed and they trying to be cleansed and purified so they have to you know fix the error of their ways or if not they perish so that's what i'm thinking something like that i could be wrong of course i probably am wrong who knows but season one under the dome awesome little box set uh let me try to compare it to the size of a dvd case of a regular uh blu-ray case this is actually an unboxing that I'm come, that, that I'm doing soon. is a 300 themed unboxing. As you can see, the height difference there is almost half the height of a, of a Blu-ray. Uh, well, this 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 is a digi book, but it's about the half the size of a digi book. And then uh, the height itself is about exactly the height of a digi book. As you can see there, a little bit probably shorter. No, probably about the same exact thing of a digi book. So uh, there you go, guys. Uh, Under the Dome unboxing right now is available for 40 uh, what is it 47 49 on Amazon Amazon is usually about a hundred bucks get it before it's gone because then the chances are you won't get it unless you find it on eBay and they'll definitely uh, cost a lot on eBay because the dumb, dumb mofos on eBay you know they be trying to get you so yeah pretty cool definitely awesome little piece I could display this on any table and people won't know what the heck it is.
you know they will not know as a as a dvd uh blu-ray case and this is heavy guys this let me see if i can use goldie you can hear this is very nice heavy like resin or uh whatever but awesome high quality set under the dome season one blu-ray four discuses is, or is it five i don't know all right guys thank you for watching this video stay tuned for a bunch of other videos coming up soon if you haven't subscribed definitely subscribe to my channel if you like movies uh books uh tech toys i will have unboxings for all kinds of goodies like that i have a lot of movie unboxings coming up uh, i have stacks and stack i could probably show you a little sneak peek or something right here those that's a classic uh unboxing video right there if you guys know what that is then you know what, what what's coming there so there's a lot of unboxing videos coming for cinema uh some more book unboxings some awesome toys coming up soon and uh i'm gonna throw a couple sneaks of uh, some tech anything anything that's pretty awesome and fun i throw it in there as well so definitely subscribe i'm going to be giving away a lot of digital uh codes i do not use no digital codes i hate them so whenever i buy a new blu-ray a new dvd it has a digital code i'm giving it away so definitely stay tuned for that i'm also going to be posting free uh red box uh movie rental codes whenever they're available so definitely go to my fan page right now you can click on the links below uh, go to the imperial nerds facebook fan page uh follow it because i'll be posting all redbox movie codes rentals right there you'll get free movie rental codes pretty easy simple rent some free codes i'll have giveaways there as well so thank you guys for watching again uh this is the unboxing for under the dome Bye bye